Hello! Welcome to Game Over Gurken Man. This is... is Gurken Man. And this is Star Wars Shows of the Empire Part 7. We're going to whatever that is now. And by <laughs> we, I mean me and my pals here. Who are you, pals? Well, I'm Mark. I do videos and uh, animation and other things that I like to pretend I do. Solid. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Yoda, the Wookiee. Yes. Uh, <laughs> For a second, I thought this what was going to be just like the Star Wars Christmas special, and you were just going to speak in Wookiee the whole time. <laughs> Is that <laughs> reverse the polarities? Okay. So, uh, yeah, I'm Jordan Saikon. I made stuff once, um, and I keep trying, and I don't know why, but I like Star Wars. <laughs> I thought this was going to be a Star Trek game. Were there any Star Trek this games on the Nintendo 64? Very... N64, I don't think so. Are they all like ducking from you, or they were were they aiming? I think they're very short. Maybe it was a combination of them ducking they have and aiming. They kind of like duck feet. Look at they're a little feet short they're... for a stormtrooper. That's right, they... I went there. <laughs> oh look, some of the beds are unmade, but some are made. <laughs> I never thought I'd be walking through a stormtrooper's like bedroom. Is that where we These are just yeah. That's an interesting some sort of thing. barracks or something. Even stormtroopers like, need somewhere like to sleep. It's like a fucked up gold knife. <laughs> yeah, it handles like a fucked up gold knife. I can tell you that. I like how your laser just kind of, like, you're pointing it at something. You it's... notice how it just kind of deviates kind of here and there? Yeah. Well, the more you fire it, the like worse your aim gets, which is like oh, an interesting it's an, little it's mechanic. A hypo droid. Yeah, those are around. They're annoying. They're annoying. So where so on this on? thing? I can't remember why we can't. Oh, to get some information from a computer. We need the computer's files. Dash Rendars <laughs> is a regular old hacker. You gotta be a ha you gotta be a hacker and a smuggler and a bounty hunter all in one in uh, the Star Wars universe. That's how it works. R two D two is the only hacker in the Star Wars universe. We must download the porn of Vader. No, oh, porn dear. Vader. <laughs> Oh, just, oh. So much, oh. so many Twi'leks. As soon as we get home, we're uploading this damage trap.com. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> Mark, I don't you know, remember those droids from the movies. Hut, there's probably hut porn in the, uh, the Star Wars hut universe. Porn. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> hut on Ewok action. I've seen some hut porn just on regular porn sites. Jabba the slut. Oh, dear. <laughs> They didn't want to see the, the Clone Wars series, they had a Zero on that, but like... She sounded like Eric Cartman and she was a trans... who was a transsexual hut. It was... It was very right. strange. <laughs> oh! Oh, my big brother Jabba! Oh, the phone! It's just, it just like, what is this? That was pretty good. Pooh Jabba! Oh! Uh, Jabba! <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, we're turning into Game Grumps. We have to stop this before it gets too extreme. I'm really sad that, that Cosby was never in Star Wars. He would have made a great... I just he would have made a great like Mace Windu. <laughs> Brilliant. Well, when you were talking about... When you were talking like that, I was imagining Jabba the Hutt with Cosby's voice. Like... <laughs> that would have been pretty good. There you go. Oh, so this, somebody animate this. There's your somebody neck. Animate Look, we've got our first <laughs> Game Over Gurkha Man animated. There you go. <laughs> Take that, Game Shut Grumps. Cosby the, the, the Hut. Cosby the Hut. Like, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Fat Albert episode, but it's Cosby the Hut. Nice dissolve. <laughs> yeah, you like that? I kept falling off this fucking spinning thing. <laughs> Was that nice. an added chip resolve? Did you do that in Premiere? I did do that in Premiere. <laughs> I edit all of these in Premiere, for those of you wondering what I edit these in. For the record, Premiere is a fucking nightmare. What? I have such trouble. I, I had the worst trouble with Premiere recently, and I'm getting off subject, but it was... I... I Premiere to me is like that little hole in the Death Star. Oh, yeah. I have to try to... <laughs> I have to try to hit that hole. Just right to get my video to export correctly. That's how I because I'm shooting in the fucking dark here. I'm the fact. Just a few more seconds. Wait for the fucking, you know, uh, encoding. What is it called? I don't even know. Rendering. Yeah, the rendering. Rendering. Dash rendering. 
So yeah, I'm in a weird position, I guess, where like I I I know how to use Final Cut, I know how to use Final Cut X, I know how to use Premiere. The only thing I haven't really had any experience with is Avid because I have never needed I to for to work. School. Well, I didn't learn at school. I kind of like learnt on the job through trial and error. Oh. Yeah, I that's annoying around. coming up here into this. That was a jerk. Dick move, designers. Dick move. <laughs> yeah, for a second Fucking... I was like, did you just hit the ceiling? <laughs> and take damage from the ceiling? That would have been pretty funny. Worst elevator you're ever. You're too tall. You're not, you're not Stormtrooper <laughs> height. Flip <laughs> my fucking head on this door doorway. Oh, <laughs> this room. <laughs> memories, <laughs> memories we share. Yes. Still, my dog keeps farting. It's so terrible. <laughs> oh look, they had physics. Yeah. Look at, look at that. Stuff falls. Laser these, disintegrate. Like, four ah. Only like four, there's like a four phase. How many is it? One, two. One, okay, one, two, three, yeah, three. three. Is it four? Or four so. phase. Oh, oh. yeah. Ah. Ah. You're oh, running yeah. out of laser ramp. Oh. <laughs> Weren't yeah. you supposed to use those boxes to, to, to stack them up to go up to the top? Yeah, probably. I think that's multiple ways of solving the puzzle that is this room. You just want to destroy everything. I just like shooting everything, watching it explode. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Little tiny box. Is any little of this box. is any of this bringing back any memories, Psychon? Uh, any of this seem familiar? The, it just feels like Goldeneye at this point, and there's a lot of <laughs> texture using usage. I think that was just a thing to do with the gen that generation of consoles. There was always it's crazy to me that there was a time. You know, we don't, don't think about it that much. We, you know, going back with all the Game Over Cooker Man stuff with the N64 phase. We don't really. I don't. I personally think about you. Like the transition was such a smooth thing that we don't. I don't think a yeah. lot of people think back to how terrible these looked. Some but of them, it, if the art direction is the good, they were amazing. Yeah. 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 Well, I mean, that's what we were saying a couple episodes ago. This is like one of the better looking games on the Nintendo 64, and it came out at launch. Like even though the backgrounds are a bit bland, the the character models are really like pretty well, detailed you know, for the time. I, I think. What's really crazy is that there's been we we spent all these years go, going from and I know I'm getting off topic here but no um, that's all right we spent we spent all these years going from like these these two we, you know eight bit to sixteen bit to thirty two bit to sixty four bit and we're constantly like you know up up the slope of you know uh, graphical it's... yeah like the way it looks and how it feels and how to the point where video games a lot of them today. You're mostly playing a cinematic. You're, it's an interactive movie. You're yeah. Oh, yeah. Final yeah. Fantasy is a big, <laughs> you know, <laughs> my, well, first comes to mind. But at the same time, in the indie gaming market, you're seeing a regression to this. Well, because in indie games, this. they want games to be fun, which is something that the the main. Uh... And I, yeah, no, I'm and I'm not arguing. I, I think that actually the. Uh, you can do a lot more with. Um, I think visually, I'm, I'm a big fan of the 2D. The 3D stuff's really great, but uh, I think it depends like on the really type of game. Start. What's that? It depends on the type of game, really. Like yeah, you know, a lot of 3D stuff. Like, that's why I appreciate the fact that like the Bioshock games aren't really realistic. Like they're rendered semi-realistic, but they have the character designs are a bit more characterish and. Oh yeah. They're not trying to be like super or... realistic, like fucking Call of Poo. Call of Duty. Everybody's <laughs> favorite game, Call of Duty. Call of Duty. You should just do a whole series on that. On Call of Duty. Yeah. <laughs> I'd rather eat my duty than do Call of Duty. <laughs> uh, no, seriously though, I would rather eat shit. You know what's really funny is that at this point <laughs> in the game, like as we're looking at the screen here, uh, calling our attention back to the video, I would say <laughs> that it would be very difficult to, d to discern that this was a Star Wars game at this point. <laughs> yeah, all the all the interiors of the later fucking... levels. It kind of looks like iRobot, oh. actually. Yeah, yeah. It's Which is like... funny because this came out first. So maybe iRobot was based on this. I'm pretty sure iRobot came out in the '50s. Not the movie, the book. Oh, I talk about the movie. You know, like you, you don't think it looks like you know, the, book? In the movie where Will Smith's out there in that big like they're all storaged oh. in the storage bin. Oh. It looks like that oh, place. Yeah. Where, like I expect all those robots to come out like human in danger. I like the product <laughs> placements in that movie. Get out of here, C-3PO. I sure could use a new pair of classic oh. Converse All Stars. Where can he be? <laughs> <laughs> Keep me out! 
So are they trying to barricade the closets from you? Because these are the worst placements of boxes to ever. Look, name one game that had really good placement of boxes. Tetris. Yeah. Well, Goldeneye. Uh, Goldeneye didn't even... <laughs> on the train. Uh, on the oh, train yeah. level. Yes, you have to yes. get behind there, and on hard mode, that shit was... It was very important. And I'm going to be playing through Goldeneye at some point. You know, I've never played through all of Goldeneye. I've only played the odd level here and there and a hell of a lot of multiplayer. I never bothered I with the single series. player. I smell a new series. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, it'll be, gotta, it'll be one of the games, for sure. you got to play on, like, hard because you have more things to do in each level based on what difficulty you do. Yeah, I know. Oh, but yeah, for sure. And it's much harder yeah. to kill bad guys. Yeah. yeah. I, don't hey, have the I, don't, I don't have the patience for that. <laughs> you, it's weird that those boxes were in that doorway because there's a dude it's back here. It's not very like, practical, he, is it? How did he get? How did these guys get in and out of this room? <laughs> they just—they just did. I haven't seen—I haven't we, seen one been, bathroom on this place. put these boxes here. Stormtroopers have, have beds, but not bathrooms. It's, it's unfortunate. Oh snap! It's a That's robot. not from okay. Star Wars. It's a loader droid. That looks like something what out of. Uh, oh, is, did that actually, that kind of looks like the loader everywhere? robot from Venture Brothers. Yeah, it is a little bit like Helper. <laughs> yeah, it looks like Helper a little bit from Venture Brothers. Reminds me of that guy, that Ricardo. robot from uh, Fallout New Vegas. Loader <laughs> droid. All right, Gurk, come on, put the bullets in him. You need the golden gun. Ah, where's your lightsaber? <laughs> I don't have a lightsaber because I'm a I'm a I'm a scoundrel. Ah, oh, this game's all right. <laughs> I'm just messing. Actually, there's See? there's actually okay. good, there's a point I want to bring up is that. It seems like today, all the Star Wars games, they want you to be like a Jedi or like a yeah. Star Lord. And back in the day, it was all about you being like Han Solo or Bounty Hunter. I don't want to be fucking Luke. He's got like no personality. I want to be a badass. Yeah. Jedis aren't be, badasses. They're supposed to be keepers yeah. of the peace, not fucking badasses. Uh, what was the name of that game? Actually, the, the they were developing another Star Wars game that wasn't so Jedi based. It was based in oh, it was 1313 13 or something like that. Yeah, or some 13, weird number. Like yeah, that, that got yeah. that got canned. I heard it got canceled. Yeah, yeah. it did. Unfortunately, you found a lot the super of people really jazzed about it though. Did anyone play yeah, the Force Unleashed games? They were like, this could be really cool, but then it wasn't. <laughs> if I was going to talk about my favorite Star Wars game experience, it was probably Star Wars Galaxies. Sandbox MMO, before it's time, oh, no yeah. Jedis about, but like three or three to, there's like a handful of Jedis, until they messed it up with that CU stuff, like the whole making it World of Warcraft. But oh, yeah, that, that game, game yeah. phenomenal. That's right. I was Star Wars thinking, Galaxies. Yeah, MMO, I was thinking an, even a precursor to some of the RTSs they had, which was Star Wars, I think, Alliance. Oh, Which I remember was like, Yeah, yeah, that, that one. one was like... That was really a, uh, that was based on the Red Alert 2 engine, from memory. Oh, yeah, yeah. But yeah, that Mission was that, that was us talking about other games that entire episode. Yeah. Well, there you go. That's because that episode wasn't very exciting visually. But that's alright, because in the next episode, we're going into the sewers. Nothing screams Star Wars <laughs> like the, the sewers. <laughs> With the poop. So join us. Yes, all the, all join the us for the, the poop, poop next week. Yeah, by that point.